all right creatives you welcome back to my youtube channel i'm the person here i trust you are all doing well um i hope you have been seeing this kind of designs with lens flare and glowing effects on it yeah like this one that one this one that one this one that one this one that one yeah so there are many of it with these glowing effects and lens flare i hope you have seen them and today i'm going to show you the simplest way to achieve that simplest way to add lens flare or glowing effect on your design so first you have to get your design and you have to get the lens flare so i have my design here right i have my design here i'm going to add the lens flare to it and always make sure that when you are you want to add a lens flare to a design you have to make sure the background of the design is bright color is in bright color or it, it is white color are you getting me so that it will blend well with the background other than that it will not blend well you get something like this that's not encouraging you know yeah so um we, the app we are going to use to uh, add the lens flare or the glowing effect to our design is pixart right it's pixart so let me go to my pixart and this is the pixart right this is the pixart icon so let me tap on my pixels and let me import the the design that i'm going to add the lens flare to it so you come to your gallery you just choose the design you are going to add your lens flare to it so let me tap on this particular design here right so this is the design right i'm going to add my lens flare to it so when i come here i will come to down here you will see add photo here you see add photo so you tap on add photo and this time we are going to bring the lens flare yeah as i told you, you have to get a lens flare before you start the process all right so here's the lens flare this is it so i'll give it to you if you don't have it then you use in your designs so this is the lens flare i'll place it here right once you place it here place it as um the part of design where it will reflect or it will blend with the background right so you place it somewhere here and then we come to blend we come to blend and we select these are the options for the blend these are the features or the tools for the blend you have normal you have screen this is screen this is multiple this is darken this is lighting this is overlay and add the ones i will um, advise you i will recommend to you is the add and the and the screen one that one works best for this kind of um lens flare yeah so it depends on what you want to do but i normally use the screen one this is the screen one and this is the art the art is also good so i will choose the art for this tutorial so i will place it here you see very nice very nice i have my lens flare effect very simple so i want to place one here and add that one here so i'll come to copy you see this tool here tap on it and tap on duplicate so you make duplicate of it and place the other one here too so that you have two like this very nice so we are having our lens flare and our glowing effect on our design very nice place it at a part make sure that place it at a part where um it will blend or it will reflect on the background are you getting it yeah so we have it here let's now save it let's tap on this check mark here and save our design so we tap on the check mark and then we save right it has been saved to our gallery so now i'll head to my lightroom i'm going to increase the quality the design quality so that it will look more beautiful for, to me yeah this is not compulsory this is not part of the process but i just want it to look more beautiful so when i come here i will tap on design here and i will tap on edit I have a full tutorial on how to retouch your images or how to um give edit your images and design so um this that's the same process you are going to use here you can check on my channel or you can check on the description for the link to watch that video so when i come here i will tap on effects and i will increase the texture right and i will increase the clarity a bit too right so here's the before and here's the after this is helping me to get um the high quality effects for my design right 
so this is not part of the process though but i'm just doing it so that it i will enhance the quality of the design so i increase the detail a bit and i'll come to light and then increase the contrast a bit um reduce the whites and increase the blacks a bit so with the shadow you can yeah but i think i will not move anything for the shadow so you see very nice very nice design i have add my flare and i have retarded it a bit too so now let me save it let me save it tap on save to copy yeah so i have a message for you here i have a message to save to our gallery let's come to our gallery and let me show you something i have a message for you here when you are adding your lens flare you have to place it correctly so as i told you place it at the part where it will blend with the background and two you have to make it let you have to let it be simple you have to let it be simple don't use too much of it don't place it at areas that it don't need you don't have to place any lens flares to it and don't place it on all your designs it's not um it's not encouraging like that you know if you place it on all your designs it becomes too much so you have to let it be simple and place it correctly this is what i have for you and this lens flare effect makes your design very beautiful it's like having uh, it's like um having a sun rays uh, on image or on your design like something like this having a, a sun reflection on your design or um sunset reflection on an image something like that very beautiful so that's how it makes your design look like thank you for following if you haven't subscribed what are you waiting for please kindly subscribe and like comment and share make sure you share to at least a friend so that the person also know how to do it thank you for following